This is Life Sciences Paper 1 from November 2022. Thyroid Stimulating Hormone. Hormone C is going to be thyroxin. And how did I know? I know that the pituitary gland produces a lot of controlling hormones, of which thyroid stimulating hormone is one, and I know that gland B is the thyroid wrapped around the larynx and it produces thyroxin. So what interaction happens between thyroid stimulating hormone and the thyroid? The type of reaction is a stimulating reaction. It is causing the thyroid gland to produce a particular hormone. Identify gland B. We've already identified it as the thyroid gland. Identify hormone A. We've already identified it as thyroid stimulating hormone. Matrix, don't fall into the habit of just writing the abbreviation, explain it or expand that abbreviation. Thyroid stimulating hormone. And our next uh, op thing that we have to identify is hormone C. This is the hormone produced by the thyroid gland, which is thyroxin. And so we write in thyroxin. And you remember you're trying to spell them as accurately as possible. Name the disorder that results when the thyroid gland is overstimulated and instead of the person's neck just having this small gland wrapped around it, that gland then grows very large and it creates a big fold in the skin around the neck. What is this disorder? We know that that fold around the, the neck is called a goiter and it Overstimulation is called hyper. Hyper meaning bigger than, better than, more than. Thyroidism. So which is the disorder? The disorder is hyperthyroidism and the enlargement is the goiter. Which hormone, A or C, will be expected to be high in the blood, it's going to be thyroid stimulating hormone. And that brings us to the end of question 1.5.